Hello everyone, Sky Blue here, aka Drew. Welcome to another Sky Blue Simulations video. It's not instructional or tutorial this time. It's more of a demonstration or recordings of getting clearances, IFR clearances in various airports in Southeast Asia. The purpose of this video is for the viewer to familiarize with getting IFR clearances in general, specifically in the Southeast Asian and the East Asian region. So of course we will be spawning at different airports and we'll be getting the uh, clearances. And of course you can follow along. If you do want to look up the routes that we did, there is a route that is displayed, although it's in small text for each airport that we go to. So you could listen to what I say, you can repeat it. And then under read back from ATC, you can also pause the video and then you can also attempt it yourself. So anyway, anyway, guys, let's go ahead and get started. Hope you guys enjoy the video. All right, hello y'all. We are here in the Tola C321 here in Manila. We're loaded up as Breezy212 and A321 at bay number six. The information here is uh, Lima and runway 06 is in use. So deliveries online, let's uh, give them a shout and we'll go ahead and uh, get our clearance. So our routing is uh, Charlie Alpha Bravo, that's Cabanatuan, Bravo 462 at Esla. All right, let's go ahead and uh, get our clearance first. No clearance delivery. Hello, Breezy 212, Airbus A321 at base 6, information Lima request clearance, Lawag, level 320. Breezy 212, clearance ready, advice ready to copy. Go ahead for Breezy 212. Breezy 212, clear Lawag, cab to Romeo departure, Bravo 462, SL, flight route, climb flight level 320. And squawk 4414. Breezy 212, cleared Lawag, Cabra 22, Romeo departure, Bravo 462, SL, flight plan route, time level 320, squawk 4414. 212, read back correct, uh, Manila KNH 1011, call Manila ground 121, decimal 84, push and start clearance. 1011, and we'll call uh, ground 121, decimal 84, push and start clearance. Thank you, Breezy 212. And that's it. Anyway, yeah, that's it. That's how you get your clearance in the Philippines. Right, this time we're at Hong Kong. Information Foxtrot. Runway 07 right for departure. Stand is Sierra 45. Hong Kong ground, hello. Cathay 901. Stand Sierra 45. Information Foxtrot 321 Neo. Requesting clearance uh, Manila. Cathay 901, clear to destination Manila via Ocean 2 Alpha departure, runway 07 right, climb by FID to 5000 feet, squawk 5365. Cathay 901, cleared Manila Ocean 2 Alpha departure, runway 07 right, climb via SID to 5000, squawk 5365. Cathay 901, read back correct, report ready. Cathay 901. Okay. That's it. That's how you get your clearance in Hong Kong. Uh, very standard. Alright, so we're here now at Kuala Lumpur. We are uh, Red Cap 382 from Kuala Lumpur to Sukarno Hatta. As an A321 with information Foxtrot, a Papa 17. Let's go ahead and uh, call them up for clearance. Lumpur delivery, hello, Red Cap 382, Airbus A321 at stand. Papa 17, information, Foxtrot, request clearance to Sakarna Hatta, Jakarta. Red Cap 382, Lumpur delivery, Lumpur Red Cap 382, go ahead. Available and ready to copy. Ready to copy, Red Cap 382. Cap 382, you are clear to Jakarta, minus 1 for short departure, runway 33. 
Squawk 2114. Red 382 cleared uh, Jakarta, runway 33 and hit climb 4000. Squawk 2114 and say again SID only, Red 382. Mythos 1 Foxtrot. And declared Mythos 1 Foxtrot departure, Red 382. Cap 382, read back is correct. Contact ground 1284 push. 1284 push, thank you, Red Cap 382. So, one Foxtrot. Alright, that's it. Hey guys, uh, we are here at Singapore. Ground is online, we'll get our clearance to Manila. We are Scooter 394, Charlie 1A. And uh, we do have the ATIS information. Uh, See here, it seems information, Juliet. The Singapore ground, hello again, scooter 39 or 4, 321 at uh, Bay 18, information, Juliet, requesting clearance, Manila. Scooter 39 or 4, information, Juliet is correct, standby for ATC clearance, number 1. So, you said number 1, it says standby, we don't have to say anything, just wait. Number of contact, so we'll wait for a bit. All right. Scooter three nine four eighty six clearance. Scooter three nine four, go ahead. Scooter three nine four, clear to Manila. Toman two echo departure. Flight level three six zero. Squawk zero one zero zero. Scooter three nine four, clear to Manila. Toman two echo departure. Flight level three six zero. Squawk zero one zero zero. Three nine four, read back is quite Contact when ready to push and start. We'll call you back when ready to push and start. Let's go to 394, thank you. Alright, so that's it. That's how you get your clearance in Singapore. Yeah, we're here at Tansan Nat. Flight is Vietjet 878-321 from Tansan Nat International to Hong Kong International. We're at spot 14 with information. Uh, looks like uniform is current. And we got Tansan Nat ground uh, online. So go ahead and uh, get our clearance. Tansen not ground, hello, Vietjet 878, Airbus A321, spot 14, information uniform, requesting clearance, Hong Kong International Airport. Vietjet 878, this is ground, good evening. Flight level 350 is not available. Can you accept flight level 330 or 370? Flight level 330, Vietjet 878. Jet 878, uh, copy. You clear to Hong Kong via Kadum to Delta, part March transition, one way to Fastland. Uh, initial climb plan at 1000 feet and expect flight level 330. We're going to be 5762. Vietjet 878, say again, initial climb only. Vietjet 878 cleared Hong Kong International Airport, Kadam 2 Delta departure, Patma transition, runway 25 left, initial climb 900,000, flight level 330, squawk 5762. Vietjet 878, uh, read back is correct. Advice when ready for push and start. We'll call you back later for push and start. Thank you, Vietjet 878. And that's it. So, we said 350 was unavailable, we took 330. And I told him to repeat the initial climb of nine or thousand, uh, which I did not get initially. I thought it was like five or nine. Anyway, hey, that's it for Vietnam. All right, so here we are at Sakarnahata Gulf One Four. Is the stand on a flight to Kuala Lumpur? We're getting the clearance. This red cap three eight seven. Uh, Again, an A three twenty one Neo. Uh, call sign for this one is a uh, Sakarnahata, which uh, we're going to be calling up in just a few moments just a few moments second hot delivery hello red cap 387 golf 12 a321 neo information golf requesting clearance to uh, kuala lumpur 387 you're clear to kuala lumpur flat level 360 climb initial 240 via delta to delta departure runway 25 right squawk 2301 Red Cap 387 cleared 
Kuala Lumpur, flight level 360, initial climb level 240, delta 2 delta departure, runway 25 right, squawk 2301. Cap 387, Red Pack, Korak, contact ground 121.6. Have a great flight. Thank you, 121.6, Red Cap 387. That's it. Alright, so we're here now in Korea. We're at Jeju Airport as Korean 1286 and A321 Neo at uh, spot 1, Jeju to Gimpo. Expected SIDs to Kemet to Echo Departure off runway uh, 07. We'll go ahead and call the Jeju ground. Jeju ground, hello, Korean 1286, A321 at spot 1, information Bravo, requesting clearance to Seoul Kimpo. Korean 1286, say firm level 250. Uh, flight level 250, a firm, uh, Korean 1286. Two. I think that's right. Korean 1286, on the flight level 250, stand by. Alright. I think there is a uh, restriction on the altitude. It's 250 instead of 350, which is okay. So, I think that's also one of the... Uh, it's a short route. It's a short route. Between uh, in Korea. Just um, Jeju Ground, Korean Air 1286, go ahead. Korean Air 1286, Korean Air 1286, cleared Seoul Kimpo, runway 07, Kemet to Echo Departure, Kemet then has filed, maintain level 250, departure frequency 121.2, squawk 5206. Korean Air 1286, is correct, we'll report when ready for pushback. Thank you, Korean Air 1286. Alright, that's it. So... I like the ground controller. He did say it pretty uh, slowly. Easy to uh, easy to understand. Uh, let's see what's his name here. Seyon Pak. Seyon Pak. If I'm Seyon Pak. Um, yeah, that's my feedback for him. He's uh, not too fast. I like it. All right, guys. So that's how you get your clearance in Korea. So uh, departure frequency was uh, included here. All right. All right, we're here at Taipei Taiwan Airport. We are Starwalker 828 and A321 here at uh, Bravo 2. And the information looks like it's November. We do have delivery in ground online. So let's go ahead and uh, get our clearance. Taipei clearance delivery. Hello, Starwalker 828 A321 at Bravo 2 with information November requesting clearance to Kansai International Airport. Alright, you said standby, so we'll just uh, stand by and wait. Starwalker A two eight, go ahead. Starwalker A two eight, clear to Kansai. Starwalker one now find departure. Climb into three thousand squad two six zero one. Starwalker A two eight, say again, just the SID name only. Okay, Starwalker 828 cleared to Kansai International Airport, Molka 1 Alpha, RNAV departure, climb and maintain 3000, squawk 2601. Squawk 2601, Starwalker 828.
contact ground 121.7 and departure frequency on 125.1. Uh, when ready for push, 121.7, departure frequency 125.1. Thank you so much. Starwalker828. Okay. okay, so uh, Mulkawan Alpha Arnav Depart. I thought it was kind of like a transition. Arnav Arn Arn Departure or something. That's Arnav Departure, then 3000 and Squawk 2601. And that's it. That's how you get your clearance in Taipei. All right, we're here in Japan, A321 flight as all upon 682 from Hiroshima to Tokyo, Haneda International. We have Hiroshima Tower online as well as the outlying uh, approach and center. From spot one with information November, let's go ahead and uh, call for clearance and get started. Hiroshima Tower, hello, all upon 682, information November, A321, spot one requesting clearance, Tokyo International Airport. Nippon 682 Hiroshima Tower clear to Tokyo International Airport via Momot 3 departure Ikunoto Namishon 7 route Maintain flight level 150 Expect flight level 370 Spoke 5754 Nippon 682 clear Tokyo International Airport Momot 3 departure Ikuno transition flight plan route maintain level 150 Expect level 370 Squawk 5754 all right, that's it in Japan. All right, this time we'll get our clearance in Thailand, Suvarnabhumi Airport. Information Alpha's current uh, Suvarnabhumi Tower is online as well as Bangkok uh, Control. So, Information Alpha, Starwalker 742 at Golf 3, A321. Let's go. Suvarna Bumi Tower, hello, Starwalker 742, Information Alpha, Airbus A321neo at Stangol 3, requesting clearance, Taipei, Taiwan Airport. Starwalker 742, now hello, what do you have? Sun 5, break, break, Taiwan 2164, contact my car control 132, that's more ones, what do you have? 132, that's more ones, Taiwan 2164, that's my car, bye bye. Starwalker 742, clearance. Starwalker 742, go ahead. Starwalker 742, you clear to Taipei. Up top speed, GDX departure, runway 1 meter left. Initial climb, 6,000 feet, aspect 350, spot 7121. Starwalker 742, clear Taipei, Taiwan, up cup 3, Juliet departure, runway 19 or left, initial climb 6000, expect level 350, squawk 7121. Starwalker 742, we're back to rest, push and start. We'll call you back for push and start, thank you. Starwalker 742. Alright, that's it. That's how you get your clearance in Thailand. All right, let's get our clearance in China. We're here in Shanghai, Pudong. Tower is online. Information Juliet is current. We are here at spot six zero, as Air Spring eight six correction eight five six nine from Pudong to Seoul Incheon Airport in Korea. Let's go ahead and get our clearance now. Pudong Tower, hello. Airspring 8569, Airbus A321 at spot 60, information Juliet requesting clearance, Seoul Incheon. Airspring 8569, hello, Punan Tower, you're clear to the destination into International Airport via Lamon 81 Delta departure, runway 16 right, and the initial altitude is 900 meters, and the uh, clock. Six three two one. Air eight five six nine cleared to Seoul Incheon International Airport. Laminate eight one Delta departure. Runway one six right. Initial climb nine hundred meters. Squawk six three two one. Eight five six nine for Laman eight two Delta. Laman eight two Delta departure. Runway one six right. Air eight five six nine. 
Repair is correct. Report not ready. And the uh, departure frequency is Unicom 122.8. Frequency 122 decimal 8, and we'll call you back when you're uh, ready for push share string 856 center. Thank you. All right, so they do give the uh, departure frequency, unfortunately, neither approach, departure, or uh, the overlying center is online, but they will give the departure frequency. That's it. That's how you get your uh, clearance in China. Again, they use meters here. Our initial climb is 900 meters, which is about uh, 3,000 feet. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Hopefully, you are now more proficient or more confident or both when it comes to picking up or requesting your IFR clearances, especially in airports in Southeast and East Asia. Hopefully, this will encourage you to fly more on VATSIM. It is a very, very beautiful thing. You have ATC when they're online providing realistic services. And let me tell you guys, VATSIM, it's a whole different experience than just flying offline here in your preferred simulator. So again, guys, hope to see you guys on the next video or the next stream. Again, guys, if you did like the video, give this video a like, thumbs up, as well as subscribe here on SkyBlue. Again, I stream on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitch as SkyBlue Sims. Hope to see you guys again on the next video or stream. Sky Blue here, K. Drew. Till next time, see ya.